Hello, in this video we're going to talk about how you can post something to Padlet um, in the event that your teacher gives you a Padlet assignment. So the first thing you need to do is you need to navigate to the Padlet link that your teacher gave you. Now for me, my teacher posted that in our Google Classroom. So I'm going to go up here to Google Classroom first, and inside Classroom I'm going to look, there's the Padlet assignment right there, I'm going to click that, and over here there's the link to the Chapter 3 Reflection. So I'm going to click this link, and that will automatically take me over to my teacher's Padlet. And you'll notice I didn't have to sign in or anything like that. Um, it just takes me straight here. And look, there's nothing posted on this Padlet yet. I'm going to be the first one to post. So to make a post, what I'm going to do is head to this plus button. For me, it's in the bottom right-hand corner. I'm going to click that, and this is going to allow me to make a post. In the subject space, I'm going to type my first and last name so my teacher knows who I am. And then I've got all these little buttons over here that I can use to attach things to my post. So I can upload a file or add a link or take a picture with my camera. Uh, my, my teacher, though, wanted me to record a video reflection for this. So I'm going to click over here where it says plus 11. That's more attachment types. And that will get me this little pop up here. And you'll notice right there, there it is. There's video recorder. So I'm going to click video recorder. And then Padlet is going to look for my webcam and my mic, and I might have to give it permission to use these things the first time. So you might have to say, yes, I accept, I give it permission, and boom, there I am. So now I'm up on webcam, and to record myself, I'm just going to click this little record button. Hi, this is me. I'm recording my Padlet post right now. Um, I'm going to reflect on Chapter 3 and give you some insightful information and then tell you how excited I am to read Chapter 4. When I'm done, I'm going to press pause. And then I got a couple options. If that was really bad, I can discard and restart. Or if I think I like it, I can click playback and save. When I do that, it'll give me a chance to review my video. Hi, this is me. I'm recording my Padlet post. And if I like it, I can now click the save button here. And then it takes a second because it has to uh, render this video file and attach it to the post. But after it's done that, you'll see it shows up over here as a little preview. And now if I want, I can add a caption, I can write some more text if I want, or if all I had to do was record a video, then I'm ready to publish. So I'm going to go up here to the publish button and click that. And when I click publish, boom, there it is on my class Padlet. And as all of my classmates start to post videos, I'll be able to take a look at theirs as well. So that's it. That's all you have to do to be able to add a post onto a Padlet.